under 10 bigs were all in and small blind. Shredded potatoes, four egg whites, two eggs with yolk, salt, pepper, and Cholula. And a Marquez voice. series of poker first open event the one thousand dollar mystery bounty the four starting flights one re-entry per flight the maximum we can be in is only eight thousand dollars it begins now uh, if i do bust two bullets in this before seven o'clock when dinner break is i'm gonna head over to the win and max late reg the six hundred dollar 200k which is probably gonna be a six hundred dollar one million really under shooting their guarantees here but the goal is to bag and tag 40k starting looking to bag around 666,000 chips did i make a deal with the devil to finally have a profitable world series stay tuned and find out this is vlog number one coming to you hot i got a new editor check out these awesome whole card graphics and i'll still be providing all the b-roll and shots from the table from my iphone 11 pro max hope you guys enjoy Big summer. I might win $100,000 if I perform well. Another ACR competition. Let's go to London, baby. Too crowded today. Gonna use the bathroom, then use the kiosk to print out my ticket, and then bad sign to begin with when Party in the USA, my top five least favorite song ever, is going. There is a good sign. <laughs> How's it going? Hey, there he is, the big uh, What's up? <laughs> That's me. First break of the day for me, and we're still in 40,000 starting stack. We're sitting on 18,000. I lost every hand I tried to play, except for one. I raised Jack 10 suited, and we took down the blinds. It felt great. We're about to have 10, big, 10 bigs or so, so. Uh, we're gonna do our best to find the zone and find some good spots and not be tilted by these Munsons that are all around me. The only good news is we are nine-handed, not 10-handed, so that's good. 18-4, turns into 18. It's running bad on the color. Oh, a visitor. With a 1500 big blind, and I shove King Queen under the gun for 18,000, everybody folds. We take down a nice pot. The very next hand, early position opens to 3,000. Button flats, I'm in the big blind with pocket jacks, a great spot to shove in 20,000, we do. Early position tanks and puts in the call. We see the good news, which is ace, jack suited, and we have video. And we are out of the $1,000 mystery bounty, but the good news is I can re-enter which I'm going to do right now, and we're back in. 
Just kidding, there's a huge late reg line, so let's wait. 40,000 starting stack. I try to win a few pots and do not. The blinds at 2,500. Big blind ante, I have 24,000. In the hijack, low jack cutoff, it doesn't matter. Ace, nine of clubs, just under 10 bigs, we're all in. And small blind wakes up with ace queen. Situation. I like my chances. Oh, one club. One more. This way. Oh, chop outs. And I lose, and I'm out. Two bullets gone, and I'm out of this fucking hellhole. All right. I mean, with 2,000 people in the first flight, of course, it's going to be pretty soft. I thought my new table is pretty fun and soft, but I realized on my direct left is Josh Field, a.k.a. JJ Prodigy, one of the alleged most notorious cheaters in online history, but it's okay. Everything is forgiven and forgotten. It's all in the past. Let them play. What could go wrong? I'm not here to berate dealers, but I can berate whoever trained these dealers, man. They can barely shuffle. They can barely deal the cards out. They don't know how to push a pot. They don't know how to put a seat card out. How can you not spend more time training them? This is the World Series of Poker. Of course I'm bitter because I just lost, but it's just fucking live poker slow motion anyways, and we have to deal with even slower motion for a complete noob dealer on their first day of work at the most prestigious tournament in the world, allegedly. And just like that, $2,000 gone, plus $6 in service charges. So let's go to the win for a $600 re-entry event, 200K, probably a $1 million guaranteed prize pool, flight 1B. I love the win, let's run better. We can't, we can't run any worse. Encore property, $600 buy-in, my home court, not affiliated with the win or Encore in any way, shape, or form. Really enjoy the property, the quality of the dealers, the foremen, the decor, the high-end clientele. Check out the win slash Encore when you're in Las Vegas. Tell them Boski sent you. It will get you nothing. Let's hop in this $600. Got about an hour and a half before dinner break, max lay reg. Let's hope we're only in for one $600 bullet. I have 100% of myself for the entire summer. Don't let me go broke I'm chasing this $100,000 ACR London package. Yeah, I'm in your town, I'm coming your way, just wait up. Me and my team ain't taking no L's, I told them you don't wanna play us. We going out town with a flight in the morning, so fuck it, I'm just gonna stay up. Remember last year, I told them the price, and now they all wanna pay up. They hit me now, they coming to- With blinds at 400, 800, we're in there. 30,000 starting stack, $600 gone. Our buddy Dustin Lee joins the table. We have some friendly banter as I blind down to 17,000 with lines at 501k. There's a limp, a common theme at this table. Small blind, seems like a reg. Makes it 4,000 based on his chip dexterity. This is a not widely discussed thing, but the smoothness and grace and Coordination, one shuffles their chips, stacks their chips, especially puts chips into a pot, says a lot about their experience. A little live read for you. But it doesn't fucking matter because I got two black kings in the big blind. We shove all in, limper folds, small blind, side calls, and we're up against ace jack of diamonds. Let's hold. Here's the video. With a 1200 big blind ante, we look down at ace jack, offsuit under the gun, eight handed, make it 2500 to go. Loose player calls the cutoff, and the big blind comes along to see a flop of 963, I believe. Not a great flop for us. Action checks around, turns a jack of spades, bringing backdoor spade draw, and a lot of straight draws. Checks to us up at 4000, we get action from in position. We're heads up to see a river of five of hearts. A brick, unless they have specifically seven, eight. We check to them if they got queen, 10, king, queen, missed flush draws. They can definitely be bluffing here or overvaluing their jack X holdings. They quickly bet about 11,000. We beat them in the pot. Top tops better than top, second top, king jack in the muck. And we're up to 50,000, feeling good. With a 1200 big blind ante, 
under the gun limps. There's another limper, small blind completes. We're in the big blind with ace, queen off. I just made my food order. We nonchalantly make it 6,000 to go. Under the gun, who previously ISO'd to 5K with jack 10 and called like a 35K jam. Limp jams on us for 46,000. Everybody folds, what do you do? Just under 40 bigs, we put in five. Is he capable of just gripping it and ripping it with ace rag? Small pairs, king jack suited. Based on what I've seen, I'm here to give him action. We put in the call and we see the bad news, that's ace king. Let's get there one time. Let's get that 100K stack right before dinner. <laughs> And we do not get there. And we're down to 4,800 chips. Let's see if we can run it up. The very next hand, it folds to me in the small blind. I looked out at Ace King. We shove all in, we get the crying call from 8-6 suited or some shit. And here's the video. Sweat. Mmm, flush. We hold and we're up to 10,800. The run up right before max late entry is over. Under the gun limps, I believe a player to my right over limps. We got ace, five of spades, we're here to gamble. I'm all in, same guy on my left, wants some of that action, he re-raises. We're heads up against ace king and I tell him, well you'll see what I tell him in the video. You won't believe what happens with this ace five suited versus ace king confrontation. Oh, you're in trouble. That used to be a good hand. This hand is not better. Show him, show him the three on the turn. Oh, shit. There we go. And... Oh, wow. wow. What are the odds? 50-50, right? Oh. Yeah. It either comes or it doesn't. That's right. That's, that's, that's the logic we need. And we're out. All right. Good game. Good luck. And I'm out of the win. $600 buy-in event. Seven minutes before dinner break. So I already put in my order for Drunken Noodles. We're going to enjoy that. And in one hour, we're going to hop right back in the action. 30K stack at 1,500, big blind, 20 blinds, more than enough, very efficient. Should have just had fun for the last eight hours of my life and not fired all these bullets, but here we are. That's gambling, folks. Let's run hot after dinner. All our replies to save up. Me and my guys, we did it ourselves, so no one can say that they made us. They gave me the shit, they trying to guard me. I told them you gotta go straight up. We eating for days, I've been in the gym. I swear that I'm getting my weight up, yeah. Oh, I seen it all, you. All right, I'm really over it at this point. That drunken noodles is hitting me real bad. So, it's time to go big or go home. The blind's at 1500 big blind ante. Out of the gun, Asian tattooed male. Puts in the raise to 3000. I'm in middle position with ace, queen of hearts, and about 38,000, sweet three by 10, 8,000. Asian male on my left puts in the cold four ball, 21,000. Usually not a good sign for ace, queen of hearts. Original razor folds. I'm not buying what he's selling. We're all in. He calls, we're up against two black jacks. And here's the shocking video, must see TV. You won't believe what happens. Players in day one, day four, on the big blind lane. 1,000 and 2,000, 2,000 for the big blind lane. One, two, and a two. Next hand. Bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> and we get the full double up to 84,000. Feeling good. 1,000, 2,000, big blind. Folds to be in the small blind. Look down at the two ladies. Hello. Hello, ladies. Make it. 6,000 to go. Asian male on my direct left is in the big blind with 42,000 and he's had enough. He's all in. We snap call and he sees the bad news because he's only got East 9 offsuit. I did not remember to record this, but the board came out. Ace 8 6 4 King to give him the full double and stop us from having a very healthy stack. On break with about uh, 55,000 going to 3K big blind. Great structure at the win, 40 minute levels. Get a few shoves through, but 
no action for a few hours. Pretty, pretty slow, depressing state of affairs. Live poker has become when you aren't getting the cards, not finding the spots, just surviving. We're not giving up. 72 players remain. We get moved to a new table. Holds me in middle position. I look down at ace queen and 45,000 chips at 5k big blind. A dream spot. Nine bigs. We shove. Button shoves. And we're off the races against ace king. Nice hand. Good timing. And we have video. Let's see what happens. Big double or... And we are out of the win $600, 200K. Correction to the earlier information that I shared. I thought this was like a four day event. Uh, this is two day one flights. This is the last flight of the $600. It's not gonna be a million dollar prize pool. It's probably gonna be a half million dollar prize pool. Let's bag and tag. Bag and tag. Hell of a day. Two bullets at the WSOP, two bullets here. That's gonna to make today a total loss of $3,206. Love the service charge. Hundreds of dollars of rake paid to the casinos and over $3,000 pumped into these prize pools for all these great humans to win. Not me, not this time. Try again tomorrow.